Hey there, this is Jexy with the Systems Alliance. In this video, we're gonna go over the news that the New York Attorney General just launched a probe into Helios and Matheson, MoviePass's parent company until they decided to just split off, into whether they misled the investors. So obviously it's been a pretty rough go for MoviePass lately and Helios and Matheson, who despite just recently unlinking, are still pretty much tied together. And New York's Attorney General is using the Martin Act, which is a statute designed to protect New York investors and the integrity of the financial markets from fraud. And they're using that to go after Helios and Matheson, who by the way, released a quote saying, we are fully cooperating and are aware, but we have done nothing unethical and we've been truthful. We've done nothing to mislead the investors and we're fully cooperating. So that's generally what you hear when something like this happens, but still pretty interesting to see where this is all going. Helios and Matheson say that they look forward to proving the attorney general wrong on all of this. Once again, that's something that you hear a lot once an investigation starts. You know, everyone wants to maintain their innocence and keep as good as possible public face that you can. Of course, MoviePass has pretty much destroyed their public face, but either way. Now, of course, as you all know, MoviePass had to change their entire subscription model just to stay in business because when they were losing 100 million a quarter, also known as 1.1 million a day and over 46,000 per hour, Helios and Matheson was on pace to blow through its remaining assets within just a few months, which would probably be around now. So obviously they had to quick shift gear and start doing things the profitable way. But in doing so, some people can argue they went a little overboard. And now because of that, other subscription services like AMC A-List as well as Cinemia have taken that market share and people just aren't coming back. So now they're getting a little desperate, but people still aren't coming back. But in doing so, Helios and Matheson pretty much lost all of their value on the stock market. They're trading at an implied value of 30 million, but they also have 1.5 billion shares out there. So what does that all mean? Well, their shares before they just jumped 80% were at two cents. So maybe they got to close to four cents. I mean, once you're at two cents, 80% of that is only four cents. And they went up 80% because they said they were splitting off. But I mean, at this point, it makes you wonder if Helios and Matheson is ever gonna recover from their movie pass mistake. So let me know your thoughts on this. Do you think the attorney general is going to uncover anything? Do you think maybe they're going after them just because MoviePass is so high profile and so many people are mad at them, even though it hasn't really affected people's lives in any big way? Do you think they're doing this just to get some publicity? After all, the attorney general is only serving until the end of this year, December 31st, 2018. So is this a send off for her? Who knows? But the financials sure are a mess. That's all we can say. So let me know what you think they might find in this investigation, or do you think Helios and Matheson is on the up and up and they just made a really stupid business decision and lost all their money with MoviePass? Let me know in the comment section below. Like, subscribe, share, and hit me up on social media. Let me know what topics you'd like to hear about. Look forward to hearing from you and we'll catch you later.